Uganda has marked the Janan Luumu Day with the main event taking place at State House St. Tebe and presided over by President Jerry Museveni, who was flanked by the First Lady Janet Museveni, government officials and religious leaders. Addressing the gathering, President Museveni indicated that there was no reason for the then President Idi Amin Dada to kill Bishop Luumu, who was criticizing his government. There's no why kill a person because of criticizing you. Why? That means you are insecure. That means you are you are guilty. Uh, but it was really the structure of the of the of the state we had. We had a lot of these illiterate people, like Idi Amin, who were mining the the powerful structures of the state, like the army. So what did you expect? The politics was fragile, based on, on, on sectarianism, because that's how it had all started, the politics. And that's what you should be careful about. Museveni says their generation was able to avenge Rumu's death and will ensure that there is no repeat of past occurrences. Was able to avenge the, the death of, of, of these, of these uh, innocent people. A lot of people died were killed for no good reason. He, however, asked the clergy to be balanced in their criticism towards government. They are always attacking the government, the government, the government, the government. Yes, the government will make mistakes. But how about the ones who are fighting the government? If they also make mistakes, why do you talk about them? Why do you only talk about the government and not the ones who are attacking the government? Who are even attacking one uh, age? Like in Kampala here, people are being attacked for putting on NLM shirts. Women were being undressed. A chief, a chief, a big deal. Women were being undressed. But I have not heard child people talking about that. You said they talk about army, police, what? Okay, the army may have. The president also cautioned all those planning to destabilize Uganda's peace, saying that they will be dealt with. On his part, the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda, Stephen Kazimba Mugaru, thanked President Museven for honoring Janan Luum's day. Kazimba also credited the president for coming out to ensure that all allegedly missing people are accounted for. I am so grateful, Your ex Excellency, that you have come out to ensure that there is some investigation done and also to assure Uganda needs that people are really safe. And we hear more from you, Your Excellency. The main celebrant was the Bishop of Lango Diocese, Dr. Alfred Olua. Ananja Kalialum was the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda from 1974 to 1977. He was arrested in February 1977 and died shortly after. Although the official account describes a car crash, it is generally accepted that he was murdered on the orders of the then-president Idi Amin. Samuel Senono, UBC News.